my Detroit players. Used to be like just this big. Oh wow! Yeah, so my dad's made it up and built it back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's really cool. Well, like, I know that like it's really, really like tough business wise now but like has that changed over the years or yeah um I mean it was it was pretty like beginner at the beginning mm -hmm. and now it's gotten bigger so we got a lot more stuff a lot more things go out you know just it's different <laughs> do you have like yeah, a favorite um, thing to make like when everything is just awful and you can make something and it's the good thing is I don't bake. Oh, really? What do you I do? Don't, I don't have to bake. I just um, put it all away, clean up. I sell it to everybody that comes <laughs> in, you know. But I don't. Uh, I don't bake. Um, you know, them guys in the back take care of everything for me. So I'll have well, to hey. do any of that. It's easy for me. Yeah. So now, do you, do you get a lot of income from? I saw you do like catering and stuff. Uh, we get a lot of restaurants that come and buy quantities to put in their mm -hmm. store for bulk. Um, not too many like catering things. Um, people call in for big orders. Yeah, you know, for parties, and I'll get it all set up in a box for them, and they come and pick it up. If I can deliver, I will. Mostly downriver, that because it's my commute on the way home. So yeah, it's easier for me. Definitely. A lot West of Side Can Detroit. Canadians. Uh, oh we really? Get, yeah, we get a lot of Canadians come over. Uh, a lot of downriver people. Um, it's usually just you know that downriver and can, a lot of Canadians. Do you get a lot of new people in here very often, or is it mostly like regular customers? You know, I see a lot of different faces. Um, every weekend's different. And during the week, it's the same face. It's the same <laughs> face. It's consistent. But on the weekend, it's just a different variety of people. Okay. Yep. The three milk cake is popular. The churros. Um, like pumpkin turnovers are a big hit here. And then food-wise, the tamales are like excellent. Like, if I was going to, like, do my, get up real early and go right to the bakery and get the freshest fresh thing, what would I pick? You'd get the conchas, which is okay. a sweet bread. Um, it's a vanilla, chocolate, or cinnamon flavor. Mm -hmm. And people just love to have that with their coffee in the morning. It actually sounds amazing. <laughs> <laughs> yep. It's one of their favorites, so that's a good thing to get. All right, this is what he's making. Okay, this is uh, Carlos Rodriguez, and he's been my baker for cuantos años? Yes. Ten years. He's actually getting the dough ready to make these bunuelos. They're deep fried, almost like an elephant ear, kind of crispy, crunchy, kind of good thing. They're a dollar a piece. Hi, I'm Juanita Gonzalez Franco from La Gloria Bakery, 3345 Bagley, Detroit, Michigan. Um, we're here seven days a week, 5 a.m. to 9 p.m. and you have to come try our Buñuelos because they are delicious. <laughs>